Alright guys, two videos in one week. This is a new official record. So, um, today I have tried to make some Star Wars crepes. Spoiler alert, it didn't go super good. But in this video, I will show you how to make delicious crepes. And uh, it's a super easy, easy recipe. So, before we get into it, I'd just like to wish everybody a happy May 4th. And uh, it's hard times now, so May the 4th really be with you today, wherever you are, whether it's in quarantine or if you're also an essential worker or something like that. So on that note, let's get right into this huge crepe fail on my part, but I will show you how to make good crepes. One cup of flour, two eggs, half a cup of milk, and half a cup of water one tablespoon of butter, one teaspoon of salt, two teaspoons of sugar if you want it to be a little bit more sweet. Next up, what I would suggest as basic material for making crepes, if you've never done this before, is you're going to want a frying pan so you can get them naturally. You can make a circle and make them really nice and round very easily. Uh, you should have a mix-in bowl just to put all your ingredients in. and. Uh, just a, a normal spatula and a ladle, and you should be good just with that. All right, so now we're gonna add the flour into the bowl, give it a little tappity tap tap. We're gonna take our two eggs and crack them in. Try not to get any shell like I did. That's an Ollie classic right there. Crack your second egg, let it flop, and pierce little holes, mix it up real good. And you can hear my bird in the background. All right, now that you have a bit of a more pasty consistency, we're gonna add in the half a cup of milk and we're going to stir that in just like we did. So you're gonna see at first it's gonna be pretty clumpy, but it'll get more liquidy with time. We're now ready for half a cup of water. Mix it in real good once again. We're going to put our salt, our sugar, sugar again, and we're going to put some butter. I like to use the microwave to melt it down. All right, and we're ready to cook. All right, so we're going to put our little bit of butter. Make sure the pan is already hot. You can see the butter has started to melt, and we're just going to spread the butter a little bit everywhere. All right, make sure pot, your pan pardon me, is nice and hot. And let's get ready to start drawing. So what I tried to do here was write May 4th, um, just for like the fact that that's the date. And you can see it didn't come out good because in fact what happened is it got clogged at one spot. Anyways, so here what I'm doing is I'm covering the whole crepe with a second layer. So. This was the first crepe I made and it really didn't come out good as you can see. But basically what I'm trying to do is to make two layers. So one layer is gonna be really dark. Like this layer here, this is the second crepe, will be way darker. And then whatever I write on top of it should be lighter. So you have a dark contrast and a light contrast. Here I'm trying to make the Death Star. Um, there's that kind of famous image, I'll put it in the video. It's super simple and it's a Death Star when it's like half blown up. So here once again I'm putting it over and you see how I'm rolling the pan to get the crepe batter everywhere? That's really important, that's how you get your crepes nice and round. Here this one still, this one wasn't coming out super easy but a little bit better. Honestly, I think it's because of the two layers, but as you can see, it's really hard to see uh, if there really is any crepe. So this was the last one I made. I uh, finally got the color contrast a little bit better, but as you can see, there's still a couple of mistakes, and honestly, it didn't come out that nice. But I definitely think I, if I can get the right tools, maybe I can do this better next time. So I definitely want to try this again, and it won't necessarily be for Star Wars, but there's a tons of super easy designs I could do, a Pokeball, a Triforce, the Overwatch logo. There's a lot of potential cool stuff, so I'll definitely do that in a later video. Uh, this one today is really just kind of because it's May 4th and I like Star Wars and I just want to celebrate it, you know? Alright, let's have a bite.
delicious. And there you have it. I almost made a Death Star. A um, couple of big mistakes. Obviously when you write on a crepe you have to write backwards. Uh, backwards and uh, that little juice box thing I was using, uh, unfortunately it got clogged and I'm still trying to unclog it now. It really, uh, I can't get the little piece of, I don't know, like clump out of it. Um, and for the Death Star, the round thing is on the wrong side. The last crepe I made, uh, which I um, didn't try and make it into a Star Wars crepe, it ended up being pretty nice. It kind of looks like a moon. So we're going to say that I made a beautiful Death Star and I made a beautiful moon. And on that note, once again, happy May 4th.